Yo, B. Brandon. What? I'm up here. Dude, what the fuck? Are you? Why are you in a tree again, dude? All right, dude. For the love of God, will you please come down safely? Yeah, sure, man. There's a lot of spiders up here. You don't like spiders? No. Oh, hey there, homies and homiettes. Today, we are going to be learning the next step in our journey to more agility. Sorry. I'm a little tired because I was jumping a lot of rope today and doing the move that we're about to teach you, which is side straddle and front straddle. Let us know if you guys have questions because I'll be checking form every single day. And every single day, by that I mean every day I'm in there checking. Let's do this. All right, guys, front and side straddle tutorial for today. So what you want to do is start out every move, agility, or a trick always starts with the regular bounce fundamentals, guys. Um, those who are new, I always say this at the beginning of tutorials. And what I mean by that is feet are low off the ground, about an inch or two, not coming that far off the ground. And then elbows are in, arms are bent around a 90 degree angle, and the wrists are controlling everything. So now that we have that, guys, with the front straddle, it's really not that much different from regular bounce, but you're slightly moving your feet backward and forward together. Now this is different from last week's feet, for, or two weeks ago, I believe, feet front to back, because you're shifting your feet. This time you're keeping the feet together and doing short, low to the ground hops. So as you can see me demonstrating what not to do, you don't wanna jump very high in the air, because again, jump rope done correctly is, it is a great workout that actually does save your knees. Um, and is a better replacement than just simply jogging. So if you watch here in slow-mo, I'm up on my toes the entire time. That's super important if you wanna spin the rope fast. And I'm just going slightly back and forth. This looks basically the same as regular bounce, but just this little move can help increase your agility and also just get you more comfortable with moving your feet around, increasing your footwork, which will lead to being able to do other tricks that we'll be learning more advanced um, in the future. So now I want you guys to just take note of the form that I have here. And here's a good, uh, from the side, my arms are bent at about 90 degree angles there at my elbows. And my wrists are jutting out to the sides of my hips and just simply everything is controlled by my wrist. There's really not that much movement in my entire body. I know those of you who have seen this before are like, Dan, you say that every time, but yo, it's true. You do not have to do so much. Uh, now, side straddle, let's do this feet together check this out short back and forth back and forth back and forth basically regular bounce but you're just going short back and forth okay sorry i will never try to sing again this is a no you don't want to be like lunging like this throwing your body out this is how you get injured this is how your joints are like dude what the hell are you doing are you like jumping off cliffs short and sweet you know what i'm saying so now putting this together same thing as all the fundamentals we talked about for front straddle, but this time we're moving laterally. So everything stays the same as it would for regular bounce. My elbows are in, my wrists are controlling everything. And just like anything, guys, this is going to take some practice, even if it is very simple as uh, regular bounce. You need to be able to get down these fundamentals if you want to start learning more advanced stuff, some crossing, you know, some crazy stuff with double under, some combos, which we'll be teaching you in the future. By the way, guys, like this and subscribe if you want you know, some more tutorials and workouts and if you want to join our free 7-Day Jump Rope Challenge, click the link below. You're going to get more of these tutorials and an awesome community to talk to about it and me doing uh, random hump moves like you see right there. You know what I mean? <laughs> Brandon, you stop this. We need to go.